Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence, and in this video, I'm going to cover the issue that many Google Ads advertisers have with small budgets being spread too thin. So let's imagine for a second that we have an advertiser that has a budget of $1,000 per month. And this advertiser is only going to advertise on weekdays, Monday through Friday. So that means this $1,000 is going to be divided by 24 days in the month, 24 weekdays in the month. So $1,000 divided by 24 days means they have about $42 per day to spend. And that's in their entire account. So let's say they have two campaigns. So that means they actually have $21 per campaign to spend per day. So $21 might not be a lot for a campaign to, and it really depends on what your CPC bids are, what your cost per click is in that campaign. And that could depend on the industry, it might be a dollar or $2, but it could be five to $10. So if you're up in the five to $10 range, obviously $21 per day is not gonna be a lot. So the result of low budget and bids spread uh, too thin is that your ads are gonna get some impressions, but not a lot. And the impressions you're getting are likely gonna be not at the top of the page very often. Uh, and you may not get much click volume or and you might not spend your budget. So I think this visual, this picture of this island uh, above the surface and below the surface kind of helps to illustrate this. So if I were to do a search for like a dentist in Denver, for example, uh, we'd get some uh, search results, including ads at the top of the page. And you can kind of imagine those as being visible above the surface of the water, um, kind of like this island. And there's also gonna be some impressions at the bottom of the page, uh, or actually ads that are getting impressions at the bottom of the page. And you could kind of imagine this as being below the surface and really unseen. They might get clicked, but they're gonna have a low click through rate and they're not gonna have uh, many clicks and you're gonna have trouble spending your uh, budget if you're showing at the bottom of the page. So there's a simple fix for this and I use it with my clients often when they have limited budget and it seems really simple, but a lot of people don't think of it and I didn't think of it for a while, but the fix is just to decrease the days that you're advertising so you can spend more on fewer days rather than spreading your budget over five days, uh, five weekdays or seven days of the week. So if you look at this bar graph kind of visual, it shows the days of the week and then the bar graph is just kind of impressions. It represents impressions. So you can kind of see that you're getting impressions on these days um, consistently, but they're all kind of showing below the surface Usually that means, like I showed you, the bottom of the page, maybe even not even on the first page at all, maybe the second page. Um, so you're, the result is you're getting impressions, but you're not spending your budget and you're not getting clicks because you're not showing above the surface at the top of the page. So the fix here would be in the case of the, the numbers that I gave, the example I gave would be instead of spending $20 per day, Monday through Friday, you might try spending $50 a day on only Tuesday and Thursday. So you're splitting your whole budget or you're giving your whole budget to two days a week rather than five days a week. So the result of having higher budget and bids on two days of the week is kind of illustrated here and it means you can get impressions on those days that are at the top of the page more often kind of above the surface. It'll allow you to get uh, seen more, just more exposure more clicks, which means you're gonna spend your budget and just get more activity on your account. So it's a simple fix, but a lot of people might not think of it because they are in business every day of the week, so they wanna advertise every day of the week, but you just might not have the budget to do that. So try this in your account for a few weeks, see if it gets you some more volume if you're having trouble getting those clicks. Uh, if you used to get good volume in Google Ads, but have seen your volume drop recently and you're not sure why, you'll probably want to watch my video that gives some reasons for that happening and also some fixes. So go ahead and check out that video next and we'll see you there.